Hello ladies and gentlemen, I am the Grand Cat and today we are going to finish off the first Royal Rumble 23 event card. We have got, of course, the Octane, Braun Strowman, the Royal Rumble 23 Sami Zayn, which was the undercard, and we are now about to get ourselves the Kevin Owens event card, which will take us on to the heroic upgrade as well. So we will have three shards left to go. Let's jump right into it. As you can see there, I am deliberately using a weaker card to give myself easier opponents. That is a little trick that you can use. So we have two up arrows, two right arrows and one left arrow. So we're going to go to the top right to give us the maximum number of attacks that we can do. Of course, we're supposed to lose that one. Now we'll go for the weaker right arrow so that if AJ Styles gets taken over, then Miz can beat him as well. there so Roman is well Roman or Brock Lesnar is the only one that can attack this one so we need to use our up arrow here the one that's in the middle can still be attacked from the up or the right so that's why we need to get rid of this one and now we need two right arrows which we don't have so unfortunately we can't get a perfect game because of the position that the computer chose very mildly annoying And rather than waste time to get 8, we'll just go for 7, because it gives you the same number of shards. There we go, we have 8. I think we might even just get it from this very one here. And there we go. We have earned ourselves the Kevin Owens event card. Very, very cool to see. Make sure to lock that down because you can get rid of it. So make sure that it gets locked down. And then we're just going to take the rest and we're going to dust those as well. And the heroic ring domination has now been unlocked, which of course will give us access to another Octane card, another Royal Rumble 23, and another heroic upgrade and from what I've been told apparently the Octane card is Brock Lesnar the Royal Rumble 23 undercard is Finn Balor and then of course you have the heroic upgrade so those are things to all look forward to and also uh, we are Royal Rumble tier we've got 20 people on the team so we are currently full but as you can see we are getting ourselves that 15,000 reward and the rewards here I will show you you of course have the chance of getting a Royal Rumble 23 mail from every single one of these team battlegrounds. You, the other one you can get is just a Octane card. You also have a chance of getting two other random Octanes, which can be females. This one's only males, but these ones can be females. And the potential of two Extinction cards. Of course you get 1,090 credits, and, or super coins even, sorry. And you also get the exclusive draft pick as well, which will all help get you even more Royal Rumble 23 cards. So if you want to join that team, all you have to do is join the description down below. But now let's jump right into our Kevin Owens and see just how strong he is. So there is our Sami Zayn by comparison. You can see that this is 23 million across the board and the event card is 28, 27, 26 and 27. So it's really 27 across the board, but power is a little bit higher. And we are going to go, of course, let's change the image to a very, very nice image. This is probably the best image for big old Kevin Owens because he has the universal title over his shoulder. Of course, we've got other silly images we can use, like uh, zombie Kevin Owens. Or we've got, I think, a werewolf Kevin Owens. <laughs> and I think that's about it. Yeah, the rest of these aren't anything that's particularly special, short of the pixel Kevin Owens, which also looks a bit ridiculous. But no, this is the one we're going to go for. In fact, actually, if you want to see the very, very original, that's from season one, back when he first uh, came onto the scene. So that's a very, very rare image to see. But this is the one that I like. That's the one with the big old title, which is the big old favourite. So we're going to train him. We're going to see what he looks like at level 100. 
So we're going to get rid of our Octane Bobby Lashley because we don't really need the left and right arrows anymore. So that is level 88. We're going to use... We're going to use this universal title, I think. Because we have a Royal Rumble 23 universal title, which is significantly stronger. And that does put big old Kevin Owens up to the highest thing. So I'm going to screenshot that because that's going to be a thumbnail. And you can see there that his power is 113, toughness is 110, speed is 107, and charisma is 109. And of course, the Stone Cold Stunner gives power to both power and toughness. So, very, very nice to see. I'm really looking forward to seeing what this looks like when it's proed. And I really want to see what the heroic upgrade looks like as well. So, those are things to look forward to. Now, untrained, let's see whereabouts he stays. For about C6. And you can see that without having his 100 matches, he is already stronger than the Pro Octane Survivor Series AJ Styles. So that is very, very cool to see. You can see that he's very, very strong. Of course, he's stronger than the Fortified One Elton Prince as well. Stronger than Old Reigns, stronger than the Fortified One uh, Ludwig Kaiser and Chad Gable as well. But he is just a little bit weaker than the Pro Miz, uh, which makes sense because these are regular Octane Pros. This one is the Money in the Bank Octane Pro. This one is a seasonal event uh, Octane Pro. And of course, these ones are double heroics. So that is why those ones are a little bit stronger. And of course, the strongest one that you can get is the PvP cards. If you get those in the top 1000 they're going to be very very strong as you can see uh, that Brock Lesnar has momentum on him which is why he's a little bit more powerful but yeah you can see immediately that this Kevin Owens is going to be ginormous when it is proed so that is going to be very very cool to take a look at when it is finished. Um, we can see the other ones down here. Uh, Gunther is just a little bit weaker than Giovanni. Um, Wade Barrett is not leveled all the way up yet he's only level 71 and Giovanni is only level 104, and you can get the fortified one as well. Uh, Finn Balor, again, just a little bit weaker than what Gunther is. But that's probably because Gunther has the Intercontinental Championship that's giving him the little power bonus. And just weaker than that is currently Dexter Loomis, who doesn't have his full 100 matches just yet. So that is where we are sitting with them. And... Do I have anything else that I can do at the moment? That is a good question. Ah, yes. So, uh, I was mentioning the rewards here uh, earlier. Of course, it comes with the 1,090 uh, super coins, and we can use those in the Superstore. And you can see here that in the Superstore, you can still get the AJ Styles and the Austin Theory. They are both 18,000, so to get a pro is 36,000, but in 12 days and 19 hours, so almost just under two weeks from now, these will change and they should be Royal Rumble tiers and they'll be just a little bit stronger than what your regular Royal Rumble cards are, in the same way that this AJ Styles is just a little bit stronger than the regular Octanes. So it's well worth keeping at least 36,000 super coins so that you can get yourself that Royal Rumble Pro when it drops in two weeks time. It's well worth going out of your way to try and get those super coins. And of course you can get super coins from Team Battleground. You can also get them from playing PvP and you can also get them from Money in the Bank, which uh, there you can see. Um, well, it, it just says the rewards there is in the Superstore. But that is all the things to look forward to. Uh, I am going to get back to playing Ring Domination. I'm going to get myself this Octane Brock Lesnar. I'm going to make my way onto the Royal Rumble 23 Finn Balor, which should be a pro if this is Finn Balor. I haven't seen confirmation of that yet. I've just been told that that's what it is. And then we're going to actually get our double, her well, our single heroic Kevin Owens, and we will be getting this, the second double heroic Kevin Owens from next week's Road to Glory. So that's going to be it for this little, little video, folks. I really hope you all enjoyed. And if you did, give me a like, share, and subscribe. And if you are subscribed, make sure you click that notification icon so you can see when more of these videos go up. And we will see you all in the next video. Goodbye, everybody.